Baltimore Orioles called up their knuckleball pitcher, Mickey Janice, and he made his Major League debut tonight and struck out one of the most consistent hitters in Major League Baseball when healthy is Jordan Alvarez. Jordan Alvarez, of course, his next at-bat took Janice deep. But this is appreciation because we're finally seeing another knuckleball pitcher in Major League Baseball. We always seen Tim Waitfield, R.A. Dickey. He's a former Cy Young Award winner. You name it, all the knuckleballers, there's a, there's plenty of them. I know that I'm skipping a few, but I enjoy me a good knuckleball. If you have a good and timed out, it floats perfectly. It, it goes in different directions, of course. And that's the thing now with the with more pitchers throwing harder and faster. Just look at this ball just like this float into the glove of Austin Wayne. It's like, which, by the way, that glove is freaking massive. It's like a pillowcase back there behind the dish. But you kind of have to with this pitch because you never know. You have to have a bigger mitt so you can get a hold of it and the ball just sucks right into the pocket of the glove. But the knuckleball pitcher is a dying breed in Major League Baseball because everybody's throwing faster, they're throwing harder, they're throwing stronger. And then you get a guy like Mickey Janis who caps out his fastball at 88 but has a 82-mile-an-hour knuckleball, which is complete filthy and junky. That's perfect. That's something that you would want to have in your arsenal, especially for pitchers now these days. Heck, you could be a pitcher that throws 100 miles per hour and end up having a knuckleball that's an 82 like Janus. Like, why don't you can't you uh, see a pitcher do that? That would be so difficult to have a, a two specialties, a, a very fast fastball or a knuckleball. Or, heck, if a knuckleball ends up going and eclipsing at the 90 miles per hour. That will be absolutely ridiculous, but that's just something that may not, that will probably never, ever happen. But we have a knuckleball pitcher back in Major League Baseball and Mickey Janis. Let me know what you think. Who is your favorite knuckleball pitcher when you were growing up or just to this day? Who is your favorite knuckleball pitcher ever? Granted, I'm a little biased. R.A. Dickey's probably mine. Great story of everything, but still. Let me know what yours is in the comment section down below. Make sure you like the video, subscribe. Do not forget to turn on notifications. Have a good one.